All right, guys, here we go. Let's continue on here. Start. Oh, oh my God. Sports management company's attention. All right. So it just says the sports prospect has been noticed by a, a company here. So, all right. T-Rock, I spoke with Asher Alexander of JLS Sports. He made a good pitch, and the fact is... I do think the time is coming when you'll need more of a representative than I can offer. But what do we know about this guy and his company? I trust your judgment. I'm, I'm for it if you are. Uh, yeah. However impressive an agent's qualifications may be, the trading in of a longtime trusted mentor for a corporate wheeler dealer can feel like a scary step. You know, I wouldn't mess around with your future, T-Rock. I've vetted this guy and his company, and I think they're a great fit for you if you feel like you're ready. And you're fully confident. JLS Sports is a very reputable firm, and the fact that Asher came to see you in person tells us something about what he thinks of you and your potential. All right. Let's do it. Thanks so much for taking me this far, coach. But a fledgling must leave the nest, for a big world awaits. I'll tell him you're in. It's been such a pleasure helping bring you along to this point, T-Rock. I just can't wait to see all you're going to do in this game. A double-A manager has called one of his young players in for a quick word. You've worked hard to get your game to where it is, T-Rock, and it's been a pleasure to be a small part of that. Thank you, sir. The word is good. The promising player has been called up to AAA. Oh, nice. The team brass would like to move you over to our AAA affiliate. Laugh for real? News of a call-up, though positive, can also be shocking. It's impact taking time to sink in. That's a good thing. It means you've been promoted. But I wanted to see our season through here. Nah, okay, terrific. Within 48 hours, this player will be in a new city and a new uniform amidst players with whom he is unfamiliar. You're one step closer to and just one step away from the big leagues, T-Rock. Now go say your goodbyes. You've got a bus to catch. Go to AAA. A AAA oh, manager welcomes we a new arrival from AA. Hey, Rock, I just wanted to welcome you to the club. Thank you. This prospect showed promise at the double A level. The double A staff told me you've been playing better than double A baseball down there. So I guess this makes sense. It's a very low level of competition down there, but thanks. Just playing my game, trying to improve. The organization is hopeful his progress will continue here. Well, I, for one, am looking forward to watching you develop and seeing what you can get out of you. Welcome, kid. First impression, boost activated. Double points. Nice. All right. Is there going to be one more? Or should I turn this down? I think I can turn this down. Getting stupid YouTube in there. God dang copyrights. So guys, I've been thinking my time is really getting short and I haven't really had time to do these videos much anymore for YouTube. So in the future, I either I have to do videos very sparingly or just quit YouTube altogether because I'm, I'm entering graduate school here now, guys. So I'm not sure how much time I'm going to have. But anyways, I'll try to do my best getting videos out, but... It's baseball Without me show. getting like any recognition or anything, Brian it's kind of hard for me to be willing to keep up videos, you know. But anyways, I'll, I'll try my best, anyways, to keep going on. Harold, you take a look at our visiting club as they take the field here tonight in the bottom of the first. They come in looking to make it two in a row as they were winners last time out. And Matt, you know, you look at the split right now, but they lost the first game. Oh, nice the second, catch. You're looking at momentum is on their side. That's why I'm kind of leaning towards them here in this third game. Now to the plate, Frank Durbin, currently third on the team in stolen bases. So we'll see if he gets an opportunity to do any running in this one. Down and away, one ball and no strikes. Swing, line, drive. That's going to Oh, man. 
crap. Legs churning. He's headed for second. And he'll pull into second with one. Darn it. Well, that's the danger of throwing fastballs back to back. The guy measures the first one, then he times the second one, gets the base hit. Batting third. Left fielder. Softly hit out to short. Oh, come on, man. Eats him up a bit. Oh, really? Gosh, flip him off there. Casey Daniels, he did not play last night, but clearly back in the starting nine for this one. All right, I need a double play here. Well, Matt, this is a situation in last night's game. They didn't do a very good job driving in runs. Oh, come on. To capitalize on it, you can grow from your mistakes and be able to come back and deliver in this one here. Wow, how about that? He was tempted to make a swing at that pitch right there. That was way out of the zone, but he just kept his hands back enough. Wow, kind of an interesting pitch call there. The batter flailed at the pitch away on the previous There we go. Line, so you think you'd go right back there, but instead they decided to come in, make him prove he can adjust before you do. God dang it, man. What the heck? Threatened the zone. It's gone full now to three and two. Hoping to send him packing. Pitch on its way. Oh my god. Are you serious? Why is my freaking pitches are freaking wild right now? What the heck? Ugh. All right. Come on, man. I can't get him in the zone. What the freak? And that misses inside 1 and 0. And this one's hit on the ground but foul. Bases are loaded here, one man out. Oh, come on, dude. I'm just like a little bit late. Jeez, why can't they strike some hits harder and harder to hit? This is a big spot here. Well, he's out in front of that changeup. I tell you what, he had the honor of the fastball. The fastball, the pitch before and back with the changeup. Oh, oh my God! I can't get him to chase. He's taken this as far as it can go. Come. Looked like he tried to elevate the fastball on that two-two pitch. Come on, double play. With a pitch that yeah. What? Oh my God, guys! Come on. Great. Brandon Snyder hitting a little over 250 coming into action in this one. Oh my god, I can't. Fastball off the plate there, and it's ball one. Matt, this is how you want to start a game. First inning, you already jump on early. You get one run in, and now you have two other runners on base. You come up with a big hit here. You can really make a big dent right here in this game in the first inning. There's a swing and a ball lifted to left, but back in the seats out of play. It's one and two. Lays off two and two now. Come on, I can't freaking just hold up on every freaking ball. Come on. And a big strike out there and they'll leave a couple of runners on base and after a good start to the inning, they can't capitalize any further. Leading off for the Chiefs. First pitch coming, here it is. Mm, couldn't quite pull that swing back. He went around for strike one. Now here's the pitch. Leaves a change up high for a strike. Pretty lucky to get away with that one. There's not a situation ever where you want to throw a high change up, so I think he'll try to make an adjustment with the next one he throws. And he wasn't there. able to hit that one with an oar. The strikeout, and there's one gone. Digging in now, Emmanuel Burris. He's back in the starting lineup for this one after sitting out last night's game. And a fastball's in there for strike one. One out, nobody on. Now a bunt attempt here, but that'll get foul. It's 0-2 now. Great change up there in the dirt for the third strike. And he makes the throw to first. Burris is retired, two down now. Here comes the first pitch. Catcher. Hey, Here's a high pop-up. There we go. Is First there pitch. Nice. Makes the catch, and that'll retire the side. So they breeze through this half of the inning. Digging in for his second at-bat, Brian Goodwin. Syracuse. He'll get us going in the home Center half of inning number three. Ryan. Trying to lay one Brian. down here, but he misses strike one. Uh. Little bit low that time, maybe outside as well. Even at a ball and a strike, here's the pitch. There's a there we go. Over the outside yeah, corner. Try to get a strike out here. The one and two pitch. Nope. And there's That's one well above the zone for a ball. Two 
Ah. Darn it. Ready to deliver the full count pitch. And he pops it up. There we go. Behind second base. Hacker will stay with it as he backs up and puts it away. One gone. Trying to pick things up where we left off. Frank Durbin. Designated header. Frank there's the ah. ball, but it's low one and oh. Out of play off to the right. It's one and one. Third inning here. Three to one our score. And now there's ball two now. Seems to me like they're pitching him a little bit more cautiously after that double he had his first time up. God dang it, man. The what plate. the frick? An easy take there, and it's three and one now. A swinging bunt out in front of the Got plate. It. Throw gets him, two down. Stepping in and ready for another shot, now Jamie Valley. Perez. 0 for 1 for him here Jamie in this one. Perez. In tight at 93, ball one. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. And the changeup is way low that time. That's a good approach when you're facing a young arm you might not be too familiar with. Ah. You and see what he's got. Now he's got himself ahead in the count. Now with the base is empty, I think he needs to be careful not to just groove one here just because it's 3 0. He's a guy that could ambush you and lose one over the wall. And this misses. Oh, come on, man. The second walk he's really? here in the first three innings. Ready for another chance, Casey Daniels, and that's in there for strike one. Runner goes for second. Mitch misses the throw down. Not in time as he. Oh my God! Seriously, how did that miss? Come on, you stupid umpire! You need freaking glasses, man. And the stolen base winds up as a moot point as the inning is over. So it's no runs. Digging in to try it again. Wilmer Defoe comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. Now a swing and a fly ball. And they can't run it down. Here's the pitch. Nope. And he misses God it. dang it, man. Come on with the freaking balls already. And he'll come back with one in the third as the count moves to two and one now. Now here's the pitch. And this one's going to bounce up to the plate. An easy take there, and it's three and one now. Well, he falls behind 3 1 right now, but man, he is really throwing the ball well. He's been attacking them all game. Oh, that's one he's going to want back right there. A fastball right in your wheelhouse, and you foul it up. And here's a ball hit in the air. And that'll get down. Oh, to my. Are you kidding me? Oh, he hits a little dying quail behind the infielder. I tell you what, he couldn't have thrown that ball any better. Talk about placement. That was perfect. First baseman, Stepping in now, Brandon Snyder, Brandon as he will take Snyder. a look at strike one on a fastball right down the pipe. He's 0 for 1 thus far. And this is fouled back and out of play. Nobody out, runner on first. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Another one sent foul. Boy, good cutting hey. into that pitch as that's the first out of the inning. Some action out in the bullpen. Couple of right-handers starting to loosen up. Landon Hernandez is at the plate as he takes a cold strike one. If you're able to locate your fastball like that, you're going to have a good game. I'm not surprised to look up and say he's having a good game right now because he's been spotting that fastball pretty good most of the game. Fastball oh. way up that time for ball two. Dang it. He's set, and the 2-1 pitch. Took a wave at one around the shins with no luck. Good job of making him chase that pitch down below the strike zone. That's where you want to pitch when you're looking for the double play ball. But pretty much right at the left fielder as he takes it in for the second out. And he will scurry back to first as he'll think twice about trying to move up. Second baseman. Emmanuel Burris. My God, I can never get that call. appearance as he looks at a ball. It's 1-0. 
from the belt, the pitch. And it's a called strike to even the count at one. Well, I like that, taking that strike right there. Look, he's already walked a couple guys early. He's not throwing the ball consistently in the zone. You have to be patient and make him work. The one-two pitch. And he'll stay alive here as this is chopped foul at the plate. It'll remain one and two. Looking for the strikeout. Here's the one-two. And a fastball just a bit high. Well, you talk about fighting. He's fouling balls off, fouling them off in a one-two count. Of Got it. There. Making, and that'll do it. The inning is over. So it's no runs on a hit, no errors, and a man left. Your attention, Barack Bermundo. Pitching for Charlotte. 13 to 1 is the final lopsided score. Charlotte Whew. brought the bats in this one with 18 what? total Three hits. That's Barack complete Bermuda garbage. What the? Claims the win out of the pen. How's he get the win? That's garbage. No. I refuse to accept that. That's so stupid garbage. Do. There. I should have got the win. What? And our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. This has been a presentation of MLB The Show. For Am I missing something? Is it because he Nation maybe pitched Dr. longer than me or something? I don't know. But that's stupid garbage, though. I should have got that win. My God, that's so stupid. Alright, let's see if there's anything going to happen here. Still, that really ticks me off, though. I should have got that win. Alright. Alright, that's it.